Steam Series, championed by your Southern California Toyota dealers. Of course, the pandemic has put science and scientists in the spotlight. And in this week's STEAM series, CBS 2's Amy Johnson introduces us to a gene therapist who's working to kill cancer and COVID by silencing their signals. From COVID vaccines to potential therapies for cancer. I think we are moving into the age of uh, RNA medicine. And working at the forefront here in the Morris Lab at the City of Hope, gene therapist Dr. Tristan Scott. The opportunity to treat diseases like cancers, viral infections, that's all we're here for. In the world of RNA medicine, nanotechnology is key. That's the lipid nanoparticle formulation, which is really the, the innovation. In COVID vaccines, instructions for the body to make spike protein are delivered via nanoparticle capsules injected into the arm. Those spikes trigger that protective antibody response. But some people still develop COVID anyway. To help these patients, Tristan is developing RNA therapy designed to silence the SARS COVID-2 gene in the lungs. We've designed these small RNAs that can go and bind to and cut the viral genome like scissors. The idea, when the genome is cut, it goes silent. Viral replication stops and so does spike production in the lungs. And eliminate the virus from the tissues of the body. Of all the same disciplines, gene therapists rely most on science, especially chemistry. Attacking COVID is just the beginning. Next up, cancer. By changing the composition of the nanoparticles, you can either tailor it to go to the liver, the lungs, the spleen, and, and various other tissues. Really, that's where the technology is at. Tristan grew up in Johannesburg, South Africa, and studied microbiology and molecular medicine in college. The path he's chosen will require a lifetime of study, but by working to make a difference in the pandemic, he's already fulfilling a dream. There's a lot of optimism going forward, and as things open up, hopefully we, we can make sure that we come out of this okay.